well, welcome back to my channel in today's video i want to share with you guys this alba strong fat bunny recipe that helps me to get back to my normal shape back from all this bloated tummy and the bloated back fat it's really burnt all those fat for me in order not to waste your time let me show you how to come up with this recipe on your own recipe i used one full hand of mint leaf if you don't have a mint leaf you can also use the mint tea bag it's okay but for me it's very good if you have access to get the fresh leaf it's very very okay make sure you wash the leaf very well you are going to use both the stems and the leaves so cut it into a little bit not too tiny chopping leaves we help you to burn all those accumulated fats that stored in your abdominal part of the body that's making your tummy to be looking so bloated burn all those accumulated fats that stored at your back also making you to look all on figure <laughs> After cutting my mint leaf now I'm going to put it aside and uh, while I cut the remaining fat burning ingredients the second ingredient here is lemon if you don't have lemon you can use lime actually lime is very very good for fat burning but I don't have access to get the lime now now that is why I'm using my lemon Lemon is also an antioxidant. It will help you to break down all those fat that's stored on your abdomen. Just to slice the lemon into small some pieces and also put it aside. Um, the lemon is going to act like a sweetener to this recipe. <laughs> ingredient now is ginger like two inches of ginger it's okay so you are going to cut the ginger also and uh, put it aside the ginger will help you to break down all those fat stored up all those food stored up that is making your tummy to look so bloated you know there are sometimes it's not only fat that makes our tummy to be looking bloated sometimes it's air so if you Consume ginger with this recipe. It will help, help to flush out those air that is making your tummy to look bloated. So I'm going to add the ginger now together with the mint leaf. So just keep on watching. And please note that this recipe is not meant for somebody that is still breastfeeding. Please. Because it might affect the digestive system of your baby. Now I'm going to pour all the ingredients in, the, in my pot now. I'm going to start by pouring the mint leaves and the ginger. Then also follow the lemon and also add the powder ingredients later. The powder ingredients I'll be adding here is cinnamon. Cinnamon is very good for fat burning. It has so much of a health benefit. I'll be adding is turmeric powder if you also have a turmeric stick you can use it I don't have access to turmeric stick right now that is why I'm using my turmeric powder so turmeric powder also one tablespoon is enough my turmeric is almost finished but it will still be okay for this recipe so <laughs> turmeric has a very good medicinal benefit for fat burning especially if you want to burn the fat stored up on your abdomen or at your back this turmeric is very very important in this recipe the next ingredient i'll be using here is water i need one liter of water for this recipe so i'm going to add my water now and i'm going to let it boil for like a 15 minutes for like a five minutes now now i remember that i've not added my black pepper so now I'm going to add one tablespoon of black pepper also to this recipe. It's a very good fat burner ingredient. So I'm going to cover everything now and let it boil for another 10 minutes to make it 15 minutes. 
now it has boiled for 15 minutes i'm going to leave it now and let it settle for another 10 minutes or 5 minutes so that everything will infuse now it has settled down for 5 minutes now because i would like to take it while it's warm so i'm going to use my silver now and sieve everything then it's ready to be used if you find this my video helpful please don't forget to give your big girl that big thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't and don't forget to turn off the notification bell so that anytime i upload a new video you get to watch them on time recipe you have to take one glass in the morning on empty stomach without eating anything and you take the other one glass at last thing at night after having your dinner like of one hour after your dinner you can take it as the last thing at night before you go to bed please don't repeat this recipe every day so that you not tamper with your digestive system you drink it once in a week or two times in a week if you want a fast action so i hope you find this video helpful thanks for watching this video and i hope to see you guys in my next video